Hello everyone and welcome back to our glorious Draconian Empire here in Civilization 5. And uh, right now we have our workers who have just arrived over here in this, uh, in our iron mine close to Dragon Hall. They're gonna have to repair this because the White Walkers have destroyed it. But yeah, um, another unit needs orders so that's gonna go on for a while. Right, we have Matthew Storm, our scouts. Uh, well, you're gonna have to find out what's going on right here. Actually, you know what we're gonna do first? We're gonna use our power and walk into the lands of Harrenhal, into the domain of Harrenhal. Uh, apparently there's, I don't think there's anything interesting or too interesting over here, but we're gonna scout it out as well. But then, uh, we're definitely gonna have a look at this island. I wonder how big it is. Uh, I'm really curious. Um, it can't be that big, but yeah, I guess we're gonna find out. Um, our, uh, the Titanic is also ready to explore some more. Well, there we go. Yeah. Oh wow, they have the, the the wildlings. They have so much um, of coast already. I don't have that much coast. That's incredible. Well, I guess it just doesn't really look like it because they don't have that many coastal cities. Yeah, I definitely got to work on that. Gee. All right. Um, another unit needs orders. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, we didn't even. Oh my god. So that's. Uh, <laughs> you can see how slow my computer is. Anyway, uh, so Martin Storm has healed up. And uh, I don't think we have uh, military axes uh, or open borders, I guess I should call it, with Dragon. Uh, well, with Stannis of the, of the Dragonstone. So let's trade and see if... Uh, what do you want for this? Come on. I give you open borders. How about this? It's not at all acceptable. Let's offer a fair deal. Well, I would like to know what makes this deal work. But I guess he just he's just not interested. All right, Stannis. Well, that's your decision. But oh my God! So they have uh, composite bow. You know what? I shouldn't even have. Why? Why did they even move? I I guess I should. All right, we're just gonna run away next turn. I think we're gonna survive. Those are both ranged troops, so we, we won't die. Um, but I think we're gonna have to send over our blood riders just to deal with these guys. Um, yeah, because I think the first city we're gonna. We're gonna found it's going to be in the cold sand simply because it's closer um, uh, than the other two. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have to send our, our troops there to uh, deal with these guys. And you know what? I think we're actually also gonna send Christopher uh, over. Yeah, perhaps we can make him water as well because we need our general. We don't need our general to stick around at Tumbleton, uh, have his thumbs up his ass. So. Okay, what's this? Man's Raider wants our pearls for his spices. Interesting. Um, okay. The Wildlings want to trade. I don't think I need spices at the moment. And since I'm already in a golden age, extra happiness is not going to help me. So I'm going to say no for now. I'm, I'm sorry. But uh, I, I'm rather isolationist uh, when it comes to... Uh, Trading away my resources that I don't I don't need any other resources right now. I might need them later, but not right now. So, sorry. Uh, so we'll see how uh, how Martin does. Yeah, he's obviously being attacked. That was, I mean, I, I expected that obviously. But perhaps we can run away quickly. Apparently, an enemy is near, and Dragon Hall's starving. No way. Um, oh, I know just why because. <sighs> How many more ships do you want to build? All right, Taldak. Then you gotta eliminate this uh, encampment here. Let them stop spawning more troops. What's going on? I right know. So apparently, Dragonhall stop and we can fix that. And there we go. That was a bit odd. Now we have a Dromond right here that we're gonna have to. Right. First of all, we're gonna name this one, and this one is going to be the. Tide Dancer. Um, oops. Tide Dancer. So, um, Elix Tide Dancer Bar. Actually, no, no, no. That's his name. So, Elix Tide Dancer Barman. He is the commander. Uh, he's the new admiral of this ship. And this ship is actually called the Needlefish. Now, um, this guy actually came to us. He landed in Dragon Hall together with our main host in the beginning. However, he was knocked unconscious. Um, during a storm while we were traveling um, to Hothos. Now, um, he has been in a coma for about a year, um, and he just recently, well, got out of coma and uh, regained his consciousness, and now that he knows that um, the king 
needs new admirals. He uh, decided that he's gonna gather his old crew and uh, get the uh, needlefish ready. And that's what his uh, ship is called, it's the needlefish. So there we go, it's a new ship and I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna actually give them uh, naval units. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have to make them patrol here. So we're gonna go forward, destroy the ship and that should deal with Dragon Hall starvation. Um, I think at least. You're no longer starving, you are no longer starving. One turn, now this is unfortunate because actually this turn was when we were supposed to uh, get the new citizen. So they actually prevented us from getting a new citizen. That's very annoying. Whatever the case, um, I think the sea wing is now going to go over here and deal with uh, this galley right there. We should deal with it right away. Yeah, there it goes. Man, I think what we're also gonna do, we're gonna have to uh, use the needlefish for now to just guard our guard the draconian sea because this seems to be a very troublesome area anyways i think that was the one enemy yeah okay and high garden is ready for new project well how about you build a, hmm, a courthouse yeah a courthouse seems like a smart idea i wonder why you don't actually have one hmm you could build a citadel a free technology Provides a free university in its city and all castles provide plus two signs. Now that actually sounds like a good idea. The citadel. Hmm. A lighthouse would also be quite useful here, I guess. Although, technically, let me check. Okay, you do have two resources. What does it do again? A lighthouse. Plus one food from coast and ocean tiles. One production from sea resources. So that would give us one food, one production in two of these things. It would actually make them rather useful. Um, but you don't really have too many people working here. Okay, I could get you away and get you on the food, but I don't think that's really worthwhile. Um, okay, what are we gonna build here? Forge, no. Courthouse, gets rid of the unhappiness. Now, it's not the most important thing, but I guess we'll do this. And actually, plus two culture. I think the monument is built so quickly. Right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to queue up some, some buildings. Uh, the monument, we're going to build the... Uh, um, we're going to build the courthouse, the aqueduct, the library, I think the lighthouse as well. And if there's time, I think we're also going to wall up this city. Since there are some wonders here, so I might, uh, I definitely want to uh, help out this, this city. Yeah, it's going quickly, so that's good. Uh, that's all we need. Uh, awesome. And I think this guy, yeah, you're safe there. Just uh, stay there. Okay, um, new production in Dragon Hall, right? Well, I guess we're just going to continue. Oh, we could build a university. Um... Two signs from jungle tiles. Well, we don't have any jungle, but we could build the citadel here. Free technology provides a free university in its city, and all castles provide plus. You know what? I kind of want to go for this one. I think we have the chance to go for this. We have enough money to build other things, although we also need a fleet. But you know what? I'm going to go for this nonetheless. There we go. Uh, we have two trade routes. Uh, we have a shy mirror, so we're gonna have to now trade probably with Port Morak and King's Landings. So we need, yeah, I don't know. We need some fleets. We need more ships. I know, but I guess these ships will do for now. Uh, I want to build a citadel. Okay, so Matthew Storm, you are able to move. Oh, interesting. Look at this. So there's some uh, a veil tree rain. Uh, okay, I, I don't think, as I said, there's anything interesting here, but I definitely want to check out what this is all about and wh whatever may be over here. Pretty cool. So I guess we're going to have to go on here. All right, and then we're going to water and bark and go over there. Um, all right, so that's Christopher. Hopefully nothing bad will happen to him. Uh, this is a little bit dangerous what we're doing right now, but oh well. Okay, and uh, Martin Storm, you're going to have to go away again. Just get out of sight, uh, you know? They can't hurt you then. Okay, so let's see what we can discover here. Titanic. And I think once the Titanic has uh, made its way around this continent, we're gonna put them back as well. Um, 
And perhaps the Titanic is actually going to be the one ship that guards Ergoroth. I'm not entirely sure um, how I want to uh, spread out my navy. Uh, Kadath is still under attack. I honestly just don't really care. They're too much away. Uh, too far away. Wow! A lot of things just happened. Interesting. Um, the Iron Islands founded the new religion, the Drowned God, in the Holy City of Pike. Well, there we go. It's very late that you've done this. But, uh, okay. Interesting. Good. I can dismiss that. Um, Kadath, yeah, you're just too far away. Just can't really care about you at the moment. Um, so, a city connection between the Arbor, uh, Tumbleton, and High God has been established. Well, that is obviously very cool. And a unit can be promoted again. Wow, the Needlefish can be promoted again. And I think what's important is mobility. That's very. Oh, look at these guys. <laughs> They've run away. Okay, what we're going to do is you're strong against naval units, but you need you need to you need to move faster because that's uh, rather annoying that you only have three movements. So we're going to go and guard the Sunrise Sea while uh, my own ship will guard the Traconian Sea. Um, can we can we go here? Can we just shoot these guys? They should be dead. Yeah, there we go. All right, we killed them. Awesome. So I think Taldak then. You will just uh, fortify until you are healed uh, in runestone. Good. So I think we got this under control now. And someone got silk, I think. Or someone wanted silk? I clicked away for some stupid reason. Alright. Well, whatever. Doesn't really matter that much. Who are we? Where are we? Uh, this is Saltcliff. Now, Saltcliff, I think I'm going to queue up a couple of things as well. Now, I want you to build, hmm, well, a temple. Two happiness, two faith. We don't need the happiness right now. That's just the way it is. Um, build the library. Saltcliff, come up. And build the library. Build... I guess you could also be building a ship, right? You, you're rather quick. Um, actually, yeah. Build a temple, of course. And I think once you're done with that, you can be built... No, you're actually going to build a cargo ship. You're going to build our cargo ships. Right, we can build two more. And then we're going to send them to Dragon Hall. Awesome, I like it. Good. And, yeah, you... This city can't grow enough. I mean, next turn, luckily, the borders will grow again. But, gee, this city grows so fast in population. We hardly can keep up with, with it. And, and this worker uh, can't even improve the tiles fast enough. It's ridiculous. Truly is. We might have to buy some tiles, but again, I don't think we need to do this right now. Okay, uh, you can continue constructing this road. Do I want you to continue constructing this road? Yeah, I guess. Might as well. Um, okay. You cannot go over there in this turn, so we'll have to embark for now, and then we'll see what this is all about. Move a stacked unit. Oh, our settler has been built. I see, I see. Well, as I said, we want to get over there. So I think we're going to send our settler all the way to Tumbleton for now. It's going to take a while, but that's fine. Uh, while we get our troops over there. The Blood Riders. Yeah, let's, let's go this way. Christopher Tillon, you're not really that fast. But, alright, it's fine. Okay, the Titanic can continue its... Exploration mission. A wildling ship. Never thought I would see a wildling ship. Okay, you're gonna heal up. Yeah. Martin Storm, I can't really uh, afford to send you around right now. There's too many white walkers here. You have to wait for the Blood Riders to um, take care of this situation, I guess. Good, but I mean, our fleet production is on the way. Uh, that's great. How far are we on the technology here? 15 more turns for astronomy. That's actually a long time. That's actually quite a long time. Oh well, but we're already in the next turn. Great. So uh, let's check out where the new production is necessary. That's Pentas. All right, Pentas. Well, what are we going to do with you? Um, this is a cargo ship. Now, mm, again, I think with Pe actually a windmill might be useful for Pentas. Hmm. Although. A workshop probably gives more production in total. Um, a theater would give you extra culture, which I don't think you need here. So let's go for a library. Um, and I think that's it for now. 
you guys have built the road. That's very good. So, let's see what you guys need. You also need some improvements. So, I think we're going to go and go ahead and build. Um, yeah. I'm going to build a mine here or something. Probably. Could also build a lumber mill, I guess. These guys are going to finish the road. Awesome. And the needlefish. You're going to have to be sent to the Scorch Cape uh, to check for White Walker activity, I guess. Um, Alright, Matthew Storm. Oh, look at that! There's even a ruin that has not yet been discovered. And the continent continues over here. Very interesting indeed. Awesome, I like this. There's still things to discover. Cool. Alright, Christopher. Move over here. The Brad Light. Brad Blood Riders, there we go, Jesus. You go forward. And the Titanic, you gotta make your way around. Wow, look at that, look how many cities they have here. Lootsport is still a puppet, so yeah, they definitely took it over. Okay, the Sea Wing, we're gonna send you over there to just heal up in Flaming Peaks waters, I guess. We still haven't gotten the iron. Um, I think we just got it right now, yeah. We're not really using that much, but that's fine. Still, um, benefiting from our uh, golden age that definitely make things much faster. Uh, I'm, I'm grateful. And we're also getting so much money, it's ridiculous. And Silverdance can fire on an enemy, what? Where are these people coming from? Oh, they must have smelled, they must have smelled these settlers. Alright, well, uh, I guess Grey Fang, you're gonna have to take care of them. There you go. And you will make short work of them. Even... Oh no, they, they dealt 3 damage. Whatever will you do? They're probably in the Hidden Valley. We might have to ride out uh, and deal with them. We're gonna have a look. But for now, you can build a lumber mill for one production. Or a mine that it's gonna get rid of food. I think we're gonna build a lumber mill then. Yeah. Because food is always important. Let's build the lumber mill here. You can build some more uh, on the other places as well. Awesome. Okay, needlefish, you can continue to the north here. Okay, no activity. That's good. That's good. Um, and you have actually finished that. Great. So what do we need to do now? Um, let's see. I think we're going to build a mine right there. And other than that, I guess, you know what, I like the production, seems kind of pointless, doesn't it? If I had to get the extra money, but I don't know, maybe not. Hmm. Well, let's go, let's go build up that anyways, it's fine. And um, you are going to explode the, come on, please, something good. A map. Really? That's shitty. Especially because it doesn't show me what this is all about. <sighs> Whatever. I'll take it. Actually, you have one more move, so might as well go onto this hill. Okay, so that's the entire island, but that's still... It's a, it's a cute little island, I guess. And there's more to discover here. I wonder how far this stretches. I guess we're gonna find out uh, soon. Alright, you will... Uh, I don't know if I should send him over here. I guess not. Um, Blood Riders, could you? You could land there, I think. I'm not sure. No, you couldn't. Well, whatever. You're, you're right there now. Okay, there's these guys. That's fine. Now that the Blood Riders are that close, I'm... Uh, I feel safe. And look at how many ships. Look at the big fleet. Of the wildlings. I mean, no, those are only tree rames. There's no dromons, but still, they have so many ships. It's ridiculous. Um, at some point, it must have had a bigger navy than, uh, than the Draconian Empire, which will not do. Oh, and look at this. Look how much faith we have uh, produced. We're almost gonna have a new prophet. I don't want a new prophet. I, I gotta build something with this. I actually set this to remind me later, but apparently, it didn't actually remind me. Um, Purchase Mother of Mountains. I think we should put it on that, yeah. Purchase Mother of Mountains. There you go, that's what I want. And I think, have I built, have I bought something here yet? Yeah, let's build Nightfires here, buy them here. 
And I think we've built them in all the other cities already. We have the night fire here. And I think also in the arbor. Yes, we do. All right. Well, guys, I, uh, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. It's Yutronka, signing